Hello, hello. Can you guys hear me again? Okay, great. So, um, I just went through a Windows update, and I think Windows 10 is really not a fan of me, because it completely uninstalled all of my uh, graphic card drivers and apparently reset my OBS settings. Because for some reason it said my mic was not plugged in or set and microphone output was disabled. So there you go. <laughs> so to recap on everything that I said, yesterday was pretty good. Uh, we made a lot of progress. We just spent a lot of gold. Uh, we picked up this trinket right here, the berserk charm. I made some slight comments about how it reminds me of that little artifact thing from Berserk and maybe that's why it's called a Berserk Charm and then I upgraded a couple units, uh, Ratria and Michelle and what else? Briefly recapped on our amazing trinkets we found yesterday let me just re-show those again so we have uh, Junia's Head which has some really clutch heals uh, we got Aria Box, which is okay. We got uh, Overture Box, which is freaking amazing for anyone who wants to be a tank, namely Sinful and Foster. We got uh, a Tough Ring Back, which is good because I lost one. And we got uh, a Feather Crystal, finally. Because everyone's been begging me to find one of these, and I finally have one, and I'm very happy. <laughs> So, again, my apologies, technical difficulties happen, Windows 10 is very silly, uh, upgrade at your own risk, etc, etc. But, as I was saying moments ago to myself, apparently, we don't really want to do a medium mission because we're just going to get another focus ring. And although we did lose a focus ring, we still have one, and they're not extremely important. Like, the accuracy is great, but losing out on the dodge is kind of a big weakness. And, uh, we're not really ready for hard missions just yet. I mean, we do have a set of level 5s, but Foster is not even going to be available anyway. And, uh, the other medium missions aren't giving us very much reward. However, we will be taking a team of, uh, Wing, Hylia, Blackwing, and probably Nick. To fight the siren once a better trinket shows up. So I've decided let's just level up a couple new units, this, particularly these guys, uh, off on a short mission. And I saw, hey, a sun cloak. We could use a sun cloak. I don't have any sun cloaks. Sun cloaks are very good. <laughs> so hopefully that brings everybody back up to speed. And I'm sorry again for being a derp and not noticing my mic was muted sooner. But anywho, now that we're back, let's head out on a mission. But first, let's equip some trinkets. So, unequip, sort by character. So, for Ratria, we will use... Let's see... This is our only Hellion items right here, so we don't really like any of those. Give her that damage bracer, yep. Perfect. Uh, where are we headed particularly? We're headed to the runes. So we might want to give her the Unholy Slayer Ring. This one, yeah. Because I believe most of the things in the runes count as unholy. So that works. If I can't think of anything better to give them. Which I don't seem to. Could we use this Feather Crystal? Yeah, sure. Feather Crystal instead. Because not everything will be unholy. Then we'll go to our Highwayman. I think for Highwayman we have some stuff. Somewhere. I swear. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, he has Pistol Shot, so that's okay. And that's about it. Let's also give him... Oh, actually, we could take some really good ones. So you know what? 
Man, the damage, though. Okay, we'll give this to our highwayman. So he doesn't die. We will give the focus ring over to Michelle, who will also get the berserk charm to counteract some of that speed penalty. And then for our Vestal, we'll pop a Junia's head, because this thing is amazing, and I love every bit of it. And I think we have... okay, 8 speed on the first round is okay. Do we have any other healing things? I don't think so. In which case, we will give her... I guess Arya's box to counteract the stress damage increase here. So pretty much she's a like net gain, but massive heals. Uh, our Arbalist will hit often and hard. Same here. And for some reason this guy's a tank. Don't mind it. <laughs> or I could put this over here which I think might actually be better. Okay, let's swap these around. We'll make Ratria really tanky, really hard to hit, 31 dodge, crazy stuff. And we'll give, uh, does this guy have any melee skills? Open vein only. Don't think that's warranting that particular trinket. But we don't have much other option. Oh, we could do this. That looks good. Alright then. Let's get some provisions, shall we? So since we're headed to the runes, we'll pick up a good amount of food. Like, all of it. Grab three shovels, because we're going on a long one. Grab a couple holy water. A couple keys some medicine, some holy water, some more holy water, and a couple of bandages. And I think that's good enough. Could take one anti-venom for fun. Okay, looks good to me. Let's head out. Man, oh man. Okay, just gotta explore 90% of the rooms, so let's head this way. I didn't bring any torches. Oh crap. <laughs> okay, we dark run. No problem. We've done dark runs before. Now uh, let's put a key in this display case. Nice start. Ouch, traps suck. Well, it may be a dark run and all, but we do have two healers, so hopefully that offsets all the drama we're going to go through. And we do have two logs for camping. I mean, it's not optimal, considering we have two level zero characters, but we'll see how it goes. Wouldn't be a run with me without a little bit of failure off the bat. Right, guys? Got a lot of money so far, though like in it. Okay, what do we want to do here? We got the range damage up. Dark run, boys. Yep. Could increase our damage, or we can just try and kill something. Damn. Maybe our list can pick it up. No sound. Hopefully there's sound now. And we'll... Stun this guy. Okay. 
No sound in game. Oh man. Settings. Okay, I'm gonna restart the stream for the last time, and I swear that's a. Give me.